All right, I'm gonna start a series of videos coming up here on uh, cooking. Believe it or not, uh, I was a professional chef for a number of years, back when I was a teenager, and I've never really lost the thing of liking to cook. So um, we're gonna be doing some videos on healthy eating and healthy cooking. And what we have here tonight for supper, and I'll show you this in the future, is if you come in here and zoom in, this is kind of in this way. Just got to work out our camera stuff. We have some chicken here, chicken breast with uh, garlic, sauteed garlic with a little bit of olive oil and actually bacon grease is how you start it out. And this green on here is parsley. Okay, so uh, this is really good stuff. I'll show how to make that in the future. Over here, we have buttered noodles. It's just regular um, wheat noodles with uh, brown butter on them. Very, very easy to make. You can make that in no time at all. And back here, we have the super mysterious, infamous black chaga tea. Mm -hmm. uh, medicinal mushroom tea. It is tastes nothing like a mushroom you'd think of. It tastes exactly like black coffee, and it is extremely, extremely good for you. So just the way it is, no yep. additives. We don't. A lot of people say you got to put maple syrup with it and whatever else. So, yeah, um, we've been praying about this, talking about this for a while. Um, yeah, teaching the, the Bible is very important. That's that's great stuff. But uh, and I'm going to continue doing that. But I know a lot of people, they're, they're, your health is affected and your health is really poor and whatever else. And we're going to teach you how to make really good food that tastes way better than anything you're going to get at a restaurant and is actually very healthy for you when you come away from the meal feeling good and your health will improve. So. Um, and the noodles are not enriched. Yeah. If, if you see enriched wheat noodles, stay away from it. Yep. It will give you nutritional deficiencies. We'll show you the noodles and stuff in the future. When we show you how to make some recipes. Our favorite meals and things like that. Uh, I do a lot of the cooking. My wife does most of the baking. And uh, that's just, we, didn't, we both enjoy cooking very much. So uh, look forward to some of these videos coming out in the future. We'll give recipes and all the other stuff. And uh, that's gonna be it. Thank you for watching. <coughs> okay, here we have some of our homemade fudge, superfood fudge. It's made out of raw cacao, a little bit of uh, maca root, um, coconut oil, peanut butter, and you can see some peanuts in it there. We like just putting whole peanuts in um, so we can be more nutty than we already are. What are you laughing at? Do you think that's funny? She's laughing too. Oh, brother. Anyhow, so we'll show the recipe for this too, but it's extremely good. There's some black chaga tea. Wonderful stuff. So it tastes delicious with the superfood fudge. Yep. Nothing That's right. added to the tea, just chaga tea, superfood fudge together is mm -hmm. incredible. The only problem with the superfood fudge is you have to keep it frozen because it does melt, you know, and then it gets on your fingers, but it's okay. Usually it doesn't last long enough, you know, to be much of a problem. Right. So you can hear Gretchen in the background <laughs> complaining. She wants more food than uh, than she gets. You know, but, um, you know, just what I was going to say there is the, the last live stream we did, the, well, the one we did on the uh, 6G, 5G thingy, um, you know, a lot of people were asking about nutritional health type of stuff, and that is a very, very important subject. And I have been talking about, you know, eating better nutritionally for people, and uh, but I really haven't shown a whole lot about how to do that. So, and I'm a former professional chef, you know, like I said earlier, so... You know, um, it's something that I need to talk to people about to help people with uh, getting their health um, figured out. So uh, that's why we're going to be doing these videos. I think it's going to be a great help to the body of Christ. And um, looking to hear, looking forward to hearing people's thoughts too, suggestions and whatever else when we're bringing out some of these videos. So uh, look forward to seeing what everybody thinks.